Uh, you don't want to send them too big. People just want to get a small image that won't be too huge. Uh, as you know, when we're teaching at some locations, there are restrictions which prevent us from doing certain things. When I'm shrinking these files down, it's very easy. It requires that you do have on your home computer Outlook or Outlook Express. Uh, it's got two or three steps. I'll do this very quickly for you. What I suggest doing here, you don't want to alter the original file. So the first thing we want to do is to create a new folder to put the new files into. So I just right click here and say new folder. And I'll call this email attachments. Okay. Now I want to send a few pictures to my buddies. Okay. As you can see, they're all like two to three thousand kilobytes or two to three megabytes. I click here, I go to thumbnails. And let's say I want to send this picture. I want to do a couple of others here. I hold down the control key. Then I control and then I click in here. I got three files. I right click inside one of the images. I say send to mail recipient. What it's going to do, I say show more options. I want to make it small on here. You can make them other things here, depending on what you need the pictures here. Uh, I say OK. It's going to take a second here. Then it's going to open up these three files in the email. If I have Outlook, I could type in the address and just mail it out. That's a nice feature here. What I want to do, though, I'm going to click on each file, hold down the control key. Doesn't let me use the control key in here. So we got to pull them in separately. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to scroll into here. I have email attachments here. I got the other thing here. I click on one file, drag it over email attachments, go into the window again, drag it into email attachments. Click over here, drag it into email attachments. And then if I go into this folder here, I've got three files. You can see they're a fraction of the size, suitable for emails. And if you just want to shrink them down and email them from your Yahoo, AOL, or whatever account, you can. Some of the programs, such as AOL or Optimum Online, may have a feature where it will shrink them down for email. Yahoo does not do that. So I don't need this anymore. Close out this window. I don't need to save it. I say no. So I've got the small files here. And then I have the big files here. So that way if I want to do some fancy work. Happy emailing. Happy shrinking.